Welcome, welcome, welcome everybody to another Sea of Thieves Rush. It's Monday, we have to get to a, an island, get boots in the sand, find something to hand in to any vendor for gold and reputation, and that is it for Sea of Thieves Rush. We have 30 minutes on the clock, what we did have when I started, we have 27 minutes on the clock now. So uh, it's uh, time to get out of here and get going. Alright, so looks like we've got the longest walk to the ship on any outpost. <laughs> So we're going to run, got a storm coming in, so let's get out before it gets in. Oh, hang on though, we have a reaper's chest right over there. I think I'm going to forego the reapers on a Monday with a storm. Well, there's another one in front. So, oh, and I missed the jump. Discompobulated this morning, just uh, really in a tears, and uh, so this is going to wake me up and get me ready to go. YouTube's being squirrely. They've done something with um, verification on uh, YouTube channels. There's been a big stink about the verification process and changing things. Um, I can't connect Restream right now. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I got my two-step authentication. I need to get figured out. So, oh. Looks like somebody may have picked up that Reapers already. Let's see where it is on the map. Yeah, look at that. There's a... Maybe it despawned. That guy might be at the Skull Fort. I'm heading out towards... Where am I going? Maybe I should go to Lone Cove. So west, northwest. Let's give that a try. See if there's anything at Lone Cove. Hope your uh, start to the week is good. Things are going well. You had a great weekend. This is my commute to work time. So I use this as a moment to stream looking around on Twitter this morning just to see what's going on and uh, a few things happening yeah it's uh, latch glue apparently is is okay and she's alive and well and played some sea of thieves with uh, one of the other people in the community so if you've been missing latch glue and wondering what's up I confirm that she's okay gonna head over here it looks closer it looks like Snake Island but I'm not sure it is from this angle I think it might be Rum Runner oh it could be the No Name Island yeah it, uh, it's the island with no name that's right that's why I didn't see it on the map so nobody around that I could see but doesn't mean there isn't there obviously was that Reapers on the map so Let's see if they show up. So first off, we need to get boots in the sand as part of the rush. And just make sure that everything is uh, is all lined up. And I get uh, something to hand in. That could be anything. I get squirreled quite easily. And this morning I'm feeling very squirrely. So <laughs> there could be anything that pops up that, that makes me change my tax this morning. Sometimes a good thing for the rush, sometimes a bad thing. It's all about making the right decisions and making sure that everything's lined up and uh, that you're getting as much speed and making all those right choices for sword lunges and routes to run and all that kind of stuff. Oh, we have a skull in the on the sand there. We saw the green glow. For some reason, my mouse is not pulling out my weapon. That's great. So. Am I actually playing my pirate? I don't know. Yeah, I am. Okay. Weird. I ended up playing my wife's pilot, uh, pirate yesterday in the stream. Tra la la boomsie. All right, we're up on the ship. We have something to hand in. We are going to put it on display right at the back here. We're not shy, that's for sure. Let's see what else there is around here. They call me Flipper, Flipper. 
faster than lightning. Okay, I flip it over to the island. I thought I could get up here. Oh man. Glitchy water this morning. Well, oh, gonna have to go up on the sandbank. There we go. Anything shiny under here? No. Nope. So it's TwitchCon. There's a lot of people traveling to TwitchCon. And uh, yeah, very envious. Would love to go to a TwitchCon one day. Um, probably would have to get uh, much more established before I get to a TwitchCon. But who knows? Maybe a chance will come up sometime. Ooh, hello. You got a sore tummy? Looks like it. Oh, poor guy. Here, is that better? <laughs> Nope, no shinies. Always like to keep an eye in the water for the odd shiny. This is where the skull was. I might just go back to the ship. Right now. Alright, a sword lunge that actually went my way. We are heading out. And, uh... Seeing what we can find at different islands as part of Sea of Thieves Rush. A mini game, boots in the sand, get what you can, hand it in, all in a 30 minute window. We have played for 7 minutes so far. I need to see where we're going and figure out uh, my next move. Mm. Maybe Cannon Cove and then Golden Sands, that, that kind of so. Head west, I can go Rum Runner, Cannon Cove. Head into the sun. Here we go. Hey, hey, hey. I've never had a thumbs down on the thumbs up emote, which is pretty obvious, but I thought maybe it would be like a coin flip and it would uh, it would do a 50-50, because it does that waggle. But I'm guessing you can get a thumbs down or a thumbs up emote and you have to buy each one. I don't know. Hey, where's Spank? Not Spank. It's, it's not Spank. That's Bolzonia's monkey. My monkey is Peter. There's Peter. Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater. His favorite time of the year is coming up, Halloween. Gets to eat lots of pumpkin. He'll be very happy. There's Arena Rock, all glowy in the night time. With the Arena Run. The arena Rock Chase, or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. There's a name for it. But. Sorry, I thought I saw something there. Rum Runner Isle, here we come. Let's see if we can find something else to go with our glowy skull. Oh, I saw some lights over there at the outpost. The ship. And it's night time, so I should really go stealth mode. Doodle doodle doodle. Let's stealth it up. Shut those hatches. Turn off that backlight. Ah, turn this one off. Why not? Mind you, I'm going dark and I've got a big, a shiny, glowy green thing on the back. It's like, hey, come look at me. Oh, stupid. Alright. Let's turn in here and have a look. Looks like there's a rowboat. Not seeing any shinies. Anything in the water? <laughs> Splash tails. Give me the evil eye. I don't belong here. Yes, I know. Oh, what are you doing? 
Here, take this. Oh, it's my monkey. Trying to kill my own monkey. There's lots of them. Oh, Skullfall just went down. So that means Karen's going to be out and about. He was hanging back, that one. He wasn't uh, coming for the old attack. I don't think I want the robot. It's just going to slow me down more than anything. Mm, no, nothing in the water. Okay, so it's a waste of time stopping here. Skelly's just slowed me down. So we are doing Sea Thieves Rush. 30 minutes on the clock. Well, 16 left. We have one thing to hand in, so I could go straight to an outpost and hand... Oh, get on the ladder! And hand it in, but uh, I'm going to go to Cannon Cove now, which is directly behind me. So. There is someone flying a reapers around here. I have no means of defense except cannons and my wits, so hopefully uh, we can do the avoidance game, but we'll see. There's lights in front, I think. Really faded light I can see right there. Oh, it's the outpost. Perfect, okay. Yeah, I'm seeing a ship too. Just behind those rocks to the left. They were at the outpost. I'm not getting good wind in the sails. Alright, let's whip those around. Quick switcheroo. Well, shows I might be dropping frames here. Yeah, looks like a brig at the outpost. Must have just spawned in, they haven't moved. Sails are down, probably anchors down. Well, if they wouldn't have just spawned in if the sails are down, right? No, you do. You spawn in with the sails down. That's right, and the anchor. I don't know. I'm second guessing myself whether you do or not. Nothing on the beach at Cannon Cove that I could see. I'm going to come around the front and have a look. Oh man, I'm slow though. I've got 14 minutes on the clock. Cannon Cove's always been one of my favourite islands. Just has that feel to it. That rowboat on the back with a harpoon, I think. Oh, no harpoon. Nothing on the beach glowing. Nothing handable, inable. That's a word, definitely. Oh, a little bit off my form for a bad day. Sorry. Hmm. Didn't stay up late or anything. It's just been a very, very busy weekend. I just feel like I've done a lot. What with our trip to Vancouver on Saturday. That really tuckered me out, I think. Lots of walking. Hard turn into the bay. I should be able to make it into the bay and then. Oh, the water changed colour, look at that. Okay, anchoring down. Ah, crap. That was a mistake. 
Don't think I got any holes. Do a quick run along the beach. If I got any holes, I can fix them on the way back, right? Doodle doodle dee, doodle doodle dum. Screw doodle, doodle, nothing to hand in, nope. Check the rowboat. Nothing in there. Sometimes there's a chest in there. Screw doodle doodle dee, and tap that. Might be something on the pier. Explodey barrel or something. There's an explodey barrel at the end. We'll take that. Just in case that brig wants to come have some fun with us. Or us have some fun with them. All depends on time. So if I run and get this thing handed in. I might be able to uh, gift them a, a barrel. Could be kind of fun. I just like to make people's adventures a little bit more interesting. With a little gift. Something that says... Hey, I love you guys. Here. Suck on this. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. Yeah, I should put that up top, but I don't have time, so. Carrying volatile cargo on the lower deck, on main deck, is never a good idea. That's why I like to do it. Okay, so that's the brig over there, at there, and the, the skelly ship clouds up, so I'm not going to get cracking. And that's the other outpost over here. So let's get the skull handed in and see what our options are. Kind of looks like a fog is brewing on the horizon, too. I don't know. Could be wrong. If I turn enough, I can get a good crosswind and get some speed. So yeah, I had a little adventure into Planet Side Arena, and I like it. It's kind of like an arena option that for C Sea of Thieves has, but for Planet Side players. So if you're a Planet Side 2 player and you want to just have that quick match arena thing, uh, it's okay. It has some bugs, like uh, falling through the planet, which happened to me and I was stuck underground for, for the first spawn in. Um, but, you know, there it's pre-alpha. And I always say with anything pre-alpha, ignore the reviews on Steam. You know, if it says mixed, then some people have given it a positive review because they've had a good experience. And some people have given it a bad review probably because they've hit a bug. Um, and that's what pre-alpha is all about. So, uh, yeah, you should ignore mixed reviews when it comes to pre-alpha. Or even alpha, you know, it's just so early in the development stage that there's going to be issues, there's going to be things they need to fix. And they know that. That's why they put it out there. They need to test it on a wider scale. And it's a massively um, multiplayer game Apparently, it's going to be. The arena mode's going to be huge. They're right now, I think they're just testing a, a three on three type thing, but I'm not sure. I, I only, when I played it, only three players were on my team. Um, but I don't think that's the limit. I think it can be more. It did remind me of Apex Legends just because I had three players on my side. <laughs> mm. Hey monkey, how you doing? Yeah, you cleaning the ship? That's a good boy. You keep it clean for me. I like it when you come and do that when I'm digging stuff up and you're like trying to help me with your little capuchin hands. Your little funny fingers. You're such a cute little monkey. Sorry, I went into crazy cutesy baby talk with my monkey. Do, 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 do. Where is that skull? Oh, there it's right in front of me. So we're spudding. It's parcel tongue. 
All the skulls speak parcel tongue. Oh, that was a weird screechy sound. What was that? That was my kidler, I think. He's actually got pro D day today. He's not sick or anything today. It's not uh, like a hard thing getting him to school today. It's it's school saying you're not coming. You're done for the day. You stay away. We're learning stuff. So, uh, just while I'm here and there's a bit of dead air, uh, I want to say thanks to Captain Peter and to Chuck Muju and Spoiler It Sucks, who all follow me on Twitch in the last 24 hours. So I do appreciate the follows. Thank you very much for the support. And uh, welcome to the extended family that is Spectrum Gaming Family. Yep. Raising awareness for the autism spectrum and particularly high-functioning autism in uh, in gaming communities and if you have any questions about high functioning autism I am happy to try and address them uh, sanctuary is north northeast We're going completely the wrong way oh sorry for that I'm gonna sneeze Oh, that was a fun one. My mic mutes when I flip up the little arm, so it's an auto mute. Really handy in the situations. Save your earlobes. Oh, there is the brig. Let's go. It might be a single player on a brig because the front sail isn't down yet. And a lot of single players using brigs don't bother with the front sail. But we will see if we can give them a present. They may actually be going to do the skelly ships. So Let's see in the next five minutes if we can give them something to chew on. Turn a bit more, get a bit more wind in the sail. So we're going to go for an intercept. Got the explosive barrel right next to me here. minutes I'm having issues trying to close this gap that was beautiful <laughs> background noises okay so three minutes 50 closing this gap but slowly maybe they've seen me now maybe they're coming towards me it just feels like they're going away, maybe in a similar direction to me. Because they don't seem to be making much ground on them. Trying. Three minutes now. Oh, maybe they've stopped. Or oh, they're slowing down. Maybe the winds change for them. Two minutes twenty. I'm not going to reach him, am I? 
Maybe they're slowing and they want an alliance. 